Hi everyone, my name is Maya. I'm a student at CSUMB and a service owner for the Monterey County Free Libraries. Um, for this Poetry Cafe, I will be uh, re reciting a poem written by Olga Orozco. She was an Argentinian poet um, and this poem is called The Ballad of Forgotten Places, translated by Mary Crow. And now I'll get started. My most beautiful hiding places, places that best fit my soul's deepest colors are made of all that others forgot. They are solitary sights hollowed out in the grass's caress, in a shadow of wings in a passing song, regions whose limits swirl with ghostly carriages. The transport, the mist in the dawn, in whose skies names were sketched ancient words of love, boughs burning like constellations of drunken flies, fireflies. Sometimes earthly villages pass, Horse trains make camp. A couple piles marvelous oranges at the edge of the sea. A single relic is spread through all space. My places would look like broken mirages, clippings of photographs torn from an album to orient nostalgia. But they have roots deeper than the sinking ground. These fleecing doors, these vanishing walls. They are enchanted islands where I can only be the musician. And who else, if not I, is climbing the stairs towards those attics in the clouds where the light of flame used to hum in siesta's honey? Who else will open again the big chest where the remains of an unhappy story lie, sacrificed a thousand times only to fantasy, only to foam? And try on the rags again, like those costumes of invincible heroes, circle of fire that inflamed time's scorpion, who cleans the window pane with her breath and stirs the fire of the afternoon? In those rooms where the table was an altar of idolatry, each chair a landscape folded up after every trip, and the bed a stormy shortcut to the other shore of dreams, rooms deep as nets hung from the sky. Like endless embraces, I slid down till I brushed the feathers of death, until I overturned the laws of knowledge and the fall of man. Who goes into the parks with the golden breath of each Christmas and washes the foliage with a little gray rag that was the handkerchief for waving goodbye and rewaving the garlands with a thread of tears, repeating a fantastic ritual among smashed wine glasses and guests lost in thought while she savors the 12 green grapes of redemption, one for each month, one for each year, one for each century of empty indulgence a taste acid, but not as sharp as the bread of forgetfulness. Because who but I changes the water for all the memories? Who inserts the present like a slash into the dreams of the past? Who switches my ancient laps for new one? My most beautiful hiding place places are solitary sites where no one goes and where there are shadows that only come to life when I am the magician. Thank you so much for tuning in and see you guys next time.